Hey, fourth graders at Cumberland Elementary, I am here to talk about social studies and another big, exciting announcement. So we've had the opportunity to ask questions to Lieutenant Governor Mandela Barnes. That was awesome. You guys came up with some great questions, phenomenal questions that were answered by him and Winona Wolf. So nice job. I'm out here asking you to come up with some more great questions because we are going to talk about, or we're going to have one more person to interview today or this week. And this person is Senator Janet Bewley. She is our state senator. So if we take a look at our chart here, this should look familiar. We've got our three branches and our three levels. We're going to be talking about the person that works right here in this box, our state senator. Her name is Janet Bewley, so she's in the legislative branch. She helps make laws in the state of Wisconsin. So right here, we are going to have the opportunity to ask her questions. She was planning on coming in next week. However, with the shutdown, that's obviously not going to happen. So we do have the opportunity to ask her some questions, and I'm going to ask you to do that. So Remember, she's in the legislative branch that makes the laws, right? Not the judicial branch or the executive branch. She's at our state level, not the federal or the local. Um, but hopefully this chart will help you with some of that. And so she is our state senator. Now we will have uh, our state assemblyman, Romaine Quinn, will hopefully also be answering some questions. Because So here's Senator Bewley. She, we are going to ask her questions. We do have Representative Romaine Quinn as well. He should be answering questions. We actually wrote some questions before our shutdown, and I sent those to him. I'm hoping that he will have a, some uh, answer those questions shortly. However, Senator Janet Bewley didn't have a list of questions yet, so we need to come up with some good ones for her. She is the senator of our 25th district. We are Barron. Barron's easy to find. It's that square dist that square county right here. This is Barron. She is the senator of the 25th district. So that's this district right here. It's kind of horseshoe shaped one up here in the northern Wisconsin. We did talk about how this district seems really big compared to some of these smaller ones down here. Um, if you remember, we talked about this before the shutdown. The reason that some of these districts are so much bigger than some of these smaller ones, and the reason for that is there's the same number of people, right? Even if you look at this one, there's actually a little insert. This picture right here is actually bigger here. The reason for that is there's the same number of people that live in this tiny little eighth district right here as there is in this entire district here. So it's the number of people are this are similar but not the area, right? So even though this, so Senator Bewley represents the same amount of people here as a senator who represents these tiny districts over here, same amount of people. So Senator Bewley is our 25th uh, state senator, or state senator of the 25th district, I should say. So she's got this area, which includes Barron County, which is us right here, and pretty much everybody in Cumberland School District. So I want you guys to submit a Socrative question. It should be, what would be a good question to ask Senator Bewley? Remember, she is a state senator. She's at the state level, not the federal or the local. The purpose of a question is to obtain an answer. So make sure that you ask a question that you want answered, a good question, and that she's in the legislative branch, the ones that make the laws. Uh, so log in to Socrative. My login is 292-450. Make sure you log into Socrative, enter your name. You don't need to restate the question or anything like that. Just tell me the question you would want to ask her, and I'll put those together and send those to Senator Bewley. So take some time. Think of a really good question you would want to ask Senator Bewley, and you have the opportunity, just like you did with Lieutenant Governor Barnes, to be able to ask a really good question to somebody who has uh, the ability to make decisions that really matter. So take some time. Think of a good question of what would be a good question for Senator Bewley. Submit it on Socrative, and we'll go from there, and I will submit it to her, and hopefully we await her response. So take some time, look at that. Look forward to reading your responses. Have a wonderful day.